hot stuff. Good morning. So this is the first morning we're getting the fish in Pensacola. <laughs> after doing two weeks of doing a bunch of work. Two weeks of hard labor. It's 517. I'm ready to go. Uh oh, somebody ready to go. Like offshore. Oh yeah, they're going offshore. Gotta get some fish bites, man. Gotta get some fish bites. There you go. How much is it? Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. Is that it? That's it. Let's do it. What's the name again? Lowell Macbeth. Lowell Macbeth. Yeah. I ran actually ran into Lowell with Gavin skating in Pascagoula, Mississippi, and here we are again in Pensacola, Gophers Bait and Tackle. Good to see you, guys. Yeah. Buddy. Nice well, to see you guys. Yeah. Well, yeah. What was your name again? Carlos. Carlos. Y'all both live in Pasquilla? Yes, we yeah. do. We're buddies. We uh, drove all the way out here with our kayaks. Going offshore? Yeah, I got the Jackson Kraken. I saw that. Y'all yeah. going out? Yeah. Good morning for it. Oh, yes. All right, guys. Nice to see y'all. All right. You have a good one? Yeah, man. Nice yeah, to meet you, buddy. I'm jealous. Tear them up. Some fish, nice man. It's going to be good. Yeah. It's going to be a great morning. All right. You have all right. A good one. All right. Later. Good morning. Welcome to Pensacola Beach. Walking through the sea oaks. There's bait right here. Throw this giant popper for a minute. There's a bait school right there. 20 yards out. Oh, they're right up to the sand. I'm just curious to see if there's a jack or something. All right, Spanish. My keeping for cub bait, I think I'm gonna throw that other rod out on bottom. Silver, you know silver reigns supreme. Yeah. Whatever fella sent me these uh, and me and Teresa a whole box of this stuff. Thanks a lot. We love it. I'm big out there feeding on the bait. I just saw it come up. Look like a cobia. Oh, that's a burner. What is that? He's way out there, man. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh, yeah, me too. Oh, yeah, another ladyfish. <laughs> the ladies are in town. That's huge, man. Jesus. Yeah, we don't have chickens. I'm gonna have to uh, get the pliers out on this guy. Chunk of fresh Spanish, big circle hook. Let's throw it on bottom to see what hits it. Oh, that blusting bait like crazy right there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Need single hooks for this. Something you always want to do is bring a rod with single with a single hook on something so when you get into schools you can release quick. Another little Spanish man. Killer. Wasn't expecting this many Spanish this close. Another Spanish! Got. Another lady? Yeah. Big one. Single hooks, man. Love the single. <laughs> Big one. Oh, you got a gotcha pro. Yeah, I had to change. It's a lot of bait, a lot of ladies. That's always a good sign for other predators. That's why we caught a couple Spanish so far. To the fella that made us these casting leads, that's my third Spanish on this guy. Spanish are loving that. I need to retire. I'm about to lose it. Total casting lead. Look at that. 
Oh, something just picked up. Something just picked it up. Something just picked it up. Something just picked it up. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, that's a big piece of Spanish on there, people. Woo! Come on and get it, buddy. He picked it up again. That's a shark. Oh, he dropped it. He dropped it. I, should, I shouldn't have set the hook. Should have let him take it. That's got to be a shark. That's a big piece of Spanish. Come on, get it. Sharks will grab it, run, drop it. Grab it, run, drop it until they finally get hooked. Come back for that, buddy. Come back for this right here. Got an acrobatic one. M2 inshore speed stick 72, I think, with the BW 3500. And he spit it. The Spanish have really loved this bait. It's almost just raw lead with a red hook. It's just the shape, the size, profile. Definitely another lady. They sure are fun. Boy, we need single hooks on these boogers. Oh, that was a good little run right there. He still got it. He still got it. Still got it. Got a bull red line out here. Yeah, he still got it. I think I'm going to tighten down on him. He might still be on. He might. Oh no, no, he's on. He's on. He's hot on it. All right, let's just let it till he takes it. Let him go. We got him again. Good. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Got it again. He's on this bait. He wants it bad. He's on. It's on. He's in that other line though. It's on. A little baby shark. <laughs> oh man. You turn them upside down, they lose their equilibrium. Let's wash them off and I'll get that hook out. Again? Alligators and sharks. And uh, lizards, and crab, lizards, <laughs> they never go upside down, so it really throws them off. He's got a pretty deep so. Alright, are releasing? Yeah. Alright, so this is let's release this little guy. Baby shark, do 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 do. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Look how pretty the water is. Yeah. Ready? Mad, yeah. Go. Ready? It's so 
little shark. <laughs> this looks like a small one. Yep, Spanish. You're right. <laughs> there he goes. You are right, ma'am. Spanish on the gotcha plug. Knock both of my rods in the ground. I'm about to go get some PVC. Damn. Almost lost that rod. <sighs> Something big just hit this rod. Knocked my bucket over. And this rod was headed into the gulf. <laughs> man, am I glad I saw that. Something big whacked it, man, and started dragging the rod. This is a 6,000. I'm not kidding you. I just had a mahi. Honey! Mahi! I just had a mahi follow me all the way to the bank. You gotta be joking me. That was a freaking mahi right here to my feet. <laughs> Man, if you could land a mahi from the beach, you'd be doing something. I don't care, I don't care what size he is. That looks like a little Spanish right there. Something, something big on bottom. Got a Spanish. Spanish mackerel. Ooh. Something just picked that sucker up and ran. Still on it. Still on it. Still on it. This is an unreal morning. Unreal. Bait is everywhere. Probably another little shark. A little shark, maybe? A red. He's going fast. Going fast. It's gotta be a shark. Yeah, a little shark. Double hookup, people. Came off? No, you still got him. These gotta be Spanish. Yeah, they're running in like Spanish. Um, I think that foul looks like a little part though. You gotta see. Oh no. Foul hooked something. Foul hooked up. Ooh, uh, leatherback. Leather. Look at the bait. There we go. When they run in like a laser, I know it's a Spanish. Yeah, Spanish. This is a better one. Oh, it's a, it's just a better Spanish. Oh, it's a skipjack. What? What? Is that Tarpon. That's tarpon. Tarpon just rolled. Really? Yes. I saw his back uh, tail. I saw his tail. Nice. Alright, you see this big old uh, cigar minna? Now, that's not really a cigar. I don't know what that is. It's like some kind of Spanish sardine or something. Comment below if you know. But I don't think it's a cig. If it is, they're huge. But I've got a fresh one on it swimming. It's swimming my little bitty balloon straight out. First class scenario, look. So don't get confused right now, folks. I'm not ballooning. I'm not using a north wind to take my bait out. I'm using the balloon as just a cork right now, just a bobber. And I have such a large bait on there that he's swimming it out. He's trying to go back to the schools or something. Oh man, we just that balloon just took off to the right. That was awesome. I didn't have the camera rolling. I wonder if he got him off. Hey, catch me another bait. Look at the mess. Look what's left. 
Yeah, I need another one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Leatherback. He's pretty. He's pretty. All right. <laughs> when bait starts flying around my balloon, I know there's a predator in that spot chasing all my bait. And I just saw bait just spraying. This one's perfect. See what they call them leatherback. Something on it? I think there's something on my balloon, guys. Oh, it just went down. Just went down. I see it. I gotta let him take it. He's back on or whatever it is. There it goes. There you go. <laughs> That cigar swam himself way out there. He is making a mess of my balloon, I know it. Got chomped. Moving to the right now. He's not, oh yeah, is he pulling? Something's on his butt now. A little shark swimming in the first gut, I don't know if y'all can see him. Pretty cool, man. A lot of bait up close. Here, as soon as you step in the water, you have a gut immediately. So it's, you know, it's like waist to stomach deep. As soon as you step in the water, a lot of stuff runs up and down the beach early in the morning. That is a huge school. Big school of bait, huh? Yeah. Big school of bait out there. You see the disturbance. So what are we doing here, Teresa? Why are we in Pensacola right now? We are closing on our house. We've sold it. We've got six days left until our closing date. So we finished up the punch list and figured let's go fishing. We've earned it. <laughs> we worked hard to finish that punch list so we oh, could hit the beach, yeah. you know. Yep. Painting. Pool cleaning. Deck. Attic. Air conditioner. Rebuilt. HVAC. I know the names of stuff now that I don't need to know the names of. <laughs> and how to fix them. <laughs> Rebuilt the soffit. Oh, yeah. Repainted the soffit. Oh, yeah. Paint, 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 paint. I felt like I was at Mr. Miyagi's school of karate. Yeah, you were. Paint the fence. Now it's paint just a... Defense. <laughs> <laughs> now it's just a waiting game until we close, so why not fish on this beautiful beach? We get to fish every day. Every day till we leave. <laughs> it's been an epic morning, guys. We've been catching a lot of the live baits on tiny, tiny, tiny leads like this. The fella that made these and sent them to us, you know who you are. Thank you very much. And um, I think we we've should take them to the floating pier live baits out by with balloon. Look at the shark. Look, there's two of them coming in. No, no, no. There's one out there, right? No? Yeah. This little guy's been hanging around all morning. Yeah, there's another one right out there. Look at him. Look at him in that school of bait. That's what sharks do. They swim in the ocean. I know it's a shocking thing. I'll get in there with him right now. Yeah. Swimming with the sharks. Swimming with the sharks. Oh. I did. Look, look, look. Don't fall.
going fishing again tomorrow. Can't wait. See y'all in the morning. What? Ooh, get him in. Is that a whiting? A whiting on a lead? No way. Heck yeah, man. A little big. No, no, he's perfect for the big rod. Uh, we got a little bait pod right here. Ooh, you see him smash right here in the surf, right in front of us? Man, now there's my bait. Good job. Yeah, it looks so small. Micro albacore. Yeah. Never seen one like that. Hey, little bitty guy. He's tiny. There's a school of them. Really? Yeah, where's your phone? Take a picture. Let me get going. Oh my God. They vibrate just like the big ones. Calm down. That little albacore is going out. He's going out, man. It's a trick, man. This is a killer bait. Yeah. It's got a little dangly single hook on it, like a butterfly. Yeah. You see that? And they're whacking it. Nice. Yeah. I think they're actually hitting that little red hook on, on purpose. And it throws a mile. I'm about to go free line that SIG. What you got there, Boogaboo? SIG? Ooh, yes. It's time to free line some baits. Let me see. Oh, yeah. That's a, I think that's a sardine. Oh, that's a beauty. It is pretty. Well, I got cut off. Something took that bonita, took the whole thing. Something cut me off. Teresa's screaming fish on. Looks like she got a, another cigar, a lady or something. Ah, uh, yeah, lady ladyfish. Yep. Oh, and he spit it. <laughs> something's on it, something's on it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Fish on, buddy. On a cigar. On a cig. Gotta have the cigs, man. Some good bait, buddy. I think it's a little shark. I think it's a shark. I saw him splashing. Nope, it's the world's largest ladyfish. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. Oh my, I gotta get a measurement. I've got to get a measurement. Can you believe this? He hit a cigar. That is a record. Can you, I've never seen one that big in my life. Almost. He is past the green little swirly thing. He's almost by to half the an green. inch. Yeah. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> he looks about two feet. All right, let's go ahead and release it. Well, record lady in the building. Let's see if we can't do that again. Incredible. You ain't caught me no more cigars? Like this off the bottom, pretty epical. Never spay, Teresa. Something is after him. Look, Benita. There you 
That's beautiful. There you go. Hold this rod. Take Dude, some, take some pictures. Oh, oh how pretty. <laughs> oh, he's a vibrating fool, man. He ain't gonna last long. Yeah. I can't even hold him. That's an albacore. That's a baby albacore. Man. This guy, this guy is not going to last long. Put him in the anal so he'll swim upward. Let's see what happens. Shouldn't last long at all. Some just whacked our Bonita. Something's got our albacore. I don't know. Huh? Lost my albacore to that little guy. That was a good bait for that guy. Shabby for a last minute PVC holder. Yeah, I like your uh, kick out. We're all packed up and ready to move kind of improvision there. You like that? <laughs> yeah. Dual rod holder. Works. Trim board and duct tape. Well, we had Lane in the garage. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, I got a little guy. Got a little shark probably. What one? There's one in the water. out of that bucket. Come on, man. There you go. I cast in micro sharks. <laughs> Over there. Like a little super duty. The world's smallest pompano. You can't yes. even keep him. That is cool, wow. man. I definitely got a picture. Another little bonita? The little bonita go fast. I like those, man. Got a big shark. Yep. Got a big shark cruising. Yeah. What you got? Oh, you got something bigger? File hook leather jacket. Oh, is it a needle? I'll take him for bait. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Cool, cool. I'll hook. <laughs> yeah, I'll take him for bait. Whole thing live.
ready to close on this house and get back to Texas. But I'm gonna enjoy every minute of this beach I can. Yeah, now that we're not painting or repairing decks, it's really nice to just lay out here and relax and listen to the waves crash. Yeah. Especially after getting up at like 3.30 or 4. Hmm? Night-night, till our list the rod goes off. <laughs>